When a freestyle rapper, pianist, and violinist go on Omegle, we pop it up. Hey, what's up? Hmm. Wow. What's up, bro? Wow. Yo, you got to think. All them blurred out dudes that just skipped it. Wow, you don't know what you just missed out on. Like, I don't know what you possibly could have been looking for in Omegle. But look at this. This looks impressive. Uh, he was trying to, you know what I'm saying? What's up, man? Hey, what's good? What's good? <laughs> Not much, bro. How you doing? I'm all right. Is this real? It's real, man. Wow, it's this very kid. real. Yo, I respect this. I know who you are, I think, bro. You look like that guy that raps, bro. I ain't going to cap. Oh, well, you know what? It's funny. <laughs> I am on here doing freestyle raps, man. Could I do one bro, for why you? Why do I keep turning yeah, the closed caption on? Sorry, it just keeps turning okay, on. Here's that the kid is going to grow up to black out and lose his left shoe at a lot of frat parties. And I just want to go ahead and give that nigga's mom a KBD award now because who that nigga about to stress that woman out? I can't even find KBD award. Come on, you know this nigga finna be hell. The dude, yeah. Ooh, and he gonna have some weed for a good weed for a reasonable price. Thing, man, I want to get you involved. So can I get three creative, challenging words? No food Maybe not and no that, animals. But he gonna go to those are the most common I'm words. Kid, Let's do okay. rainbow. Rainbow. All right. Onomatopoeia. 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 Capybara. You know, like those giant rodents. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, Capybara, we'll which is a He's giant He's way go for that, because I know what that was. Onomatopoeia and Capybara. They look like big guinea pigs, don't they? I do know what a Capybara is. Come on. Oh, yeah. I'm ready, bro. You ready? All right, banger. Yay. Let's go. Come on. Let's go. Let's go. Here's how I make Can it. Oh, you are dead wrong for that, Canada. <laughs> Y'all dare wrong for that. Yeah. Uh, Canada. Okay. Yeah. 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 Yo. I said that clear it out like Drano. Blowing up like a volcano. I know that my liver's arch just like a rainbow. Which makes sense. Because these rappers couldn't recover. I said I'm like a rainbow. How I'm blending. Ah. Yeah, nah. Come on. I found the KVD award. Cup and Y'all be... And they be setting me up to make the joke. Y'all want me to make the ju joke so they could go, go ahead and demonetize me. That nigga popped up out the closet like R. Kelly. And that nigga rapping about Rainbow. Come on, bro. Y'all, he, he fucked me up how he came up out of there. Boy, ain't slide up out the closet. Over. Okay, I'm done. Yo, I said that clear it out like Drano Blowing up like a volcano I know that my liver's arch just like a rainbow Which makes sense, cause these rappers couldn't recover I said I'm like a rainbow, how I'm blending the colors Yeah, I know I'm facing the challenge Reinstating the balance where the rainbows Because I use my color palette just to fill the canvas And that's a metaphor for how I do my art Off the top I let it pour How he cooking? They know I'm about to smash this Shut my man in the green cap and sunglasses I can see you now Hold up, Harry's rapping his ass off but was there nothing to get that closet? <laughs> Ain't no goddamn. I swear we gonna break down some bars in this month. Let's get, let's, I hope not. I, we see one more nigga. I hope not too many more people come about this closet. He said, dog, I gotta give props. I'm pretty sure I seen you freestyling on TikTok. Oh, yeah. at the top with the true vision. And I know we expanding with the musicians. I know that you see this. I ain't gonna lie, we've seen Harry, I think that's Marcus Veltri, right? We've seen Harry with Marcus Veltri because on the other side is nasty with it. Like, this world of, like, Omegle, I just, spoiler, before this came out, before Cinco de Mayo and Lil Wayne, I went to his concert and shit, I reacted to the do, which was, a, um, uh, 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 you'll see the video, he does Omegle, but, like, I was talking about how it has opened up a world of people who are just so insanely talented. Cause like, bro, Harry Mack, greatest freestyle rapper of all time, right? Boom. This Marcus Velch, what he's able to do with these keys is un stop that. This nigga, ba he really nicer than Beethoven. I don't know what cuz with the violin like, but he already came in right. I'm already feeling him. And then with the musicians, uh, I know that you see this with a one to three, they can't believe it. Can't believe it. Busy with the free flow, adding more people, go from solo to the trio. Yeah, and they never getting more to bruh by the end of this big. We about to be an orchestra. And he's using a G 
genius flow right now. It's a real like original rap flow when an MC or like the person who's rapping wasn't quite as important as the beat. And it was more of like for dancing and having fun. He's using obviously Harry's rapping a little more uh, complicated and more complex than those kind of flows, but it's still the same realm where you allow so much space for dope keys. A nigga that really get in the really, yeah, 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 ye
no cap to my bars. Uh, and that there is a promise, no cap to my bars. Like, I'm gonna keep it honest. I threw it off the cap, off the dome, off the head. I'm saying it, all the members that have met have been said. I got you going crazy, man. You clearly in the zone. Whoa, you're about to make me lose you with your phone. Ta -da! Steel, steel sharpens steel, iron sharpens iron. You know, it's, you got it. When you put this great of people together, you're going to make a classic piece of content. You look at like, look at Marcus's face while he's playing. Look at, I don't know, cuz in the back. Hey, drop in the comments. Is this Marcus Veltri? You know, come on, mine. Come on. Because that nigga sort of look like my nigga Connor from sixth grade. You know, my mama he do. But anyways, when you put this much high level talent high level musicians in a room and you just allow them to create freely like there's not like these giant companies behind it and everything even if there's like a sponsor or something it's not like a fucking warner brothers in here like hey we need to sell shirts so you guys make a lot of shirt bars this is just true art at its best and you allow people look at the fun in the room like these niggas are literally just doing what they love to do they're making bread they're traveling the world they're meeting cool people they're building a fan base meeting new people just nigga look at this this is what art should be a lot of times not the industry of art not the mass production of art for consumption monetarily just art, just some niggas having fun, just some buddies in a room. This is just at its finest. I spit, I vomit, I'm all love, funny, then we getting it done. Party so a couple places that I'm spitting it from. Yeah, shout to my man who done seen my dance. Been dreaming of this moment since I was a kid. My man in the green cap, feeling the flow. Marcus Robin, Harry Mack, and we killing the show. What's it? What a nigga named Ramen? What? <laughs> I fuck with it. That's good. Nah, cause niggas and niggas grew up eating that ramen noodles. Fuck these so I can make you I swear for God. We got a chef on this motherfucker. That nigga cannot cook better ramen noodles than me. That nigga ain't never did no county time. <laughs> oh. That was great, man. That was that was actually insane. I never thought you could rap to an orchestra. <laughs> yeah. Thank like you, I bro. saw you pull up to like the uh like the places in the streets and stuff like that. Like I saw you do a prom. Yeah. I never saw you do an orchestra before. That was insane. <laughs> <laughs> Shout out to the orchestra, yeah. man. I'm like, this guy can't get any better. And then he just pulls up with a giant orchestra. <laughs> like, What's going on? <laughs> well, that was actually insane. Was really I good. told you, he going to be cool, too. It's going to be a shame when they put him on academic probation. He gonna, He's smart, but he just parties way too much and way too hard. I can just, it, oh, I can see it, but he's going to get it together. He'll pull it all together at the end, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? You gonna, and, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have, we fuck with little Kenny. Thank That's the Kenny, that but they call him B-Rags. You made our day, man. Hey, you made our day. Kenny. Thank you for being a part of that. Hey, I mean, I'm good on the spot. You know, I make TikTok videos, too, so I respect it, man. Oh, I no, mean, no. I, I What's your that. TikTok? Uh, BH Sports. BH Sports in the building. Much I already knew. Fuck is he? I know these kind of niggas, cuz. I used to sell them all the. Love, homie. That's fire. Thank you. Yes, B sir. B-Rat or B-Rat. Maybe it's B-H. What's going on, y'all? I hope you're loving this F2 of Marcus's channel and one on Rob's channel. That's three. Rob Lands. What did I say the nigga's name was earlier? Oh, Ramen. <laughs> Proceeded to challenge chef to a ramen off, and you can get it, nigga, whenever you want. I know you watching this, nigga. Any person, he just the only nigga I know who cook. Any of y'all who think you cook like that, minus like aunties, I was gonna say black aunties, but there is some white aunties and some Asian aunties and some Mexican aunties. Ooh, and some Mexican. Whoa, okay, except for aunties, aunties. But another nigga, another man. Oh, boy, I cook your ass off. Not saying women or men or not, but I am saying that. That's exactly what I'm saying. And I cook better than every other man. Let's get it. Three times the freestyle content. So as soon as you're done watching my version, make sure you head over to their channel. Subscribe to them if you're not already subscribed. Oh, These dudes are it. incredible. I also wanted to let you know they wrote and produced all of the instrumentals that you hear in all three of the videos. Not just He's the a real nigga for shouting live, this out but also the additional drums and bass elements that are added in to make the production full. Those guys cooked up some bangers. Super oh, so there's more so sure added in post. Them. And without further ado, let's get back to the video. I thought this was going to be an ad. Canada, I spoke too soon. <laughs> I spoke way too soon. Yo, what's up? Oh my God, I love these people. <laughs> wow, thank you. 
can you play something, please? Oh, absolutely. Yes, we, we would love to. Actually, to can work, you give me boys. just three yeah. creative, challenging words to inspire my lyrics? Xylophone. The reverb in there is yep. crazy. Escargo. Escargo, which es is like cargo. snail, right? Yes. I love it. Okay, uh, xylophone, escargo. So I'm Nigerian. I'm Nigerian, okay, right? So is is snail some like bougie shit? Because I'm in Nigerian. We be eating that in all kinds of soups and shit. I ain't know that was some. We got these big, them big ass snails, boy. <laughs> big slow, stupid ass snails. <laughs> these are beautiful. Xylophone, as escargo, and you. sewing. Probably the I'm best. Let's do this. It just tastes like a muscle. This one of them teach you to breathe on a nigga. You know what I'm saying? Drop a comment, a one in the co Only real hip hop niggas be understanding 30% of the shit I say. But this is one of them joints where you just breathe on a nigga. You just. I don't even got nothing to say. I'm just breathe. Matter of fact, I think Jamal wanna breathe on y'all too. I'm done talking. Let's get to it. <laughs> Yeah, Jamal jumped on the table like y'all be Bush and hit that thumbs up. But let's get to like a thousand thumbs up. Let's go. You can let the shorts ride up a little bit. Come on, pull them out. You can let them ride up a little bit. Pull them out. Yeah. Mac ain't rap like this in a little minute. Uh uh. He ain't rap like this in a little minute. They should roll with less cargo. They should light up. Men and words are stretching them out. When I be all up in the session, I be flexing no doubt. Him and the nigga playing, Marcus is going crazier, but I got to give it to him. Him and the nigga playing violin, their souls are intertwined right now. Mac is going just, whew, I about lost my voice, I'm out of breath. He ain't did it like that in a little bit. Bro, as his flow is progressing, that nigga's getting in there and, 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 and speeding up, giving it breath, giving it pockets. And the thing about like, it's almost like, he understands how Mac should perfectly rap to the violin. And then at the same time, Mac understands, or I guess I'm saying it's backward, but he knows how to play the per violin perfectly for Harry Mac's rapping. And Harry Mac knows how to rap perfectly for his violin playing. It's like the two could not exist without each other, but together they exist, they, they create something perfect. <laughs> Wow. 
now. I was what? Was that his best freestyle of the year? I at least gotta say of the year. Was that his best? Nigga, I'm legitimately sweating in this bitch. And we got fans blown. You know what I'm saying? This is... Was that his best freestyle of the year? Drop in the comments. One if it was, two if it wasn't. Two if, and if you're putting two, I'm not mad at you, but you got to drop a reference. What freestyle can compete with it? Even if you got a maybe, you got to drop a reference. I just want to know. You know what I'm saying? Watching your TikToks yesterday. I'm not even joking. Wow. Okay, yeah. No way. Like I like how he smiles. Wow. Thank like, you. You can tell like this nigga's like, it's the most amazing thing about these humble ass niggas. They literally just perform like the greatest show ever to you. And just, uh, like, you know, just some random little girl just saying like, bro, that was really, really good. They be cheesing like little kids. Like it still hits. It still means something to them. And that's what's so fun. You could appreciate it still because they still do. Those words. How are you still breathing? <laughs> I don't actually know. Thank you. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Matt, no, don't do no, that again. No. <laughs> he started Canada. Here we go with this bullshit again. They won't even. You ever blocked an ad and they still showed it? Yo, can oh. you play? Uh, no way. I don't know. Play anything? Yeah, I'd love to. Um, so I've Master actually, God's mute. <laughs> so, so I've actually got an original song, but I need a title for it, and I'm hoping Everybody that you can help me out. Everybody got that one. Okay. So if hey, you, we all got that one friend who be ruined in the moment. <laughs> You in there with your shorty, you about to kiss her for the first time, bro, to come in. Hey, what, you know we got to go soon, right, bro? We all got that one friend. Get a KBD award for that white boy because he is that friend, yo. You can give me three random words, really creative words. Placebo. Placebo, nice. Some no words. Some hypothesis. hypothesis. And hypothesis? Yeah. Great. Is Mac I'm to think about those and uh, hope you guys dig it. You ready? Right now? Yeah. Let's go. I like how they take his shifts. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. 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 What I'm dropping is raw, drop it like your jaw. When we start rocking, they get all. There ain't nothing they can do. These three people catching rap. This is real feels. This is no placebo effect. Let's kid it. I know my bars deep in your system. Every time I start spitting, all the people gon' listen. Yeah, compared to these rappers, I'm flowing over there. When the beat, as the beat progresses, you know, even me just catching a sim, a simple rhythm, just like my hand or my head, as that beat progresses, you know. Because it's live and like they're playing it live and it's freestyling, there's a little changes to it that it's not as like streamlined and formulaic as like simple music. So like a little bit of be a little tough. You catch a little rhythm, you catch a little okay, I caught myself. The way Mac is rapping and isn't stumbling, the way Mac is kicking bars and isn't moving, you have to you have to put his like rhythm, just like the rhythm that this nigga has as a man at some of the greatest ever. Because that shit is amazing. Just nodding my head is tough. But this guy can kick lyrics, set up bars, everything as it progresses. And you can always say, well, maybe they, they did this shit before they warmed up and shit. It doesn't matter. He's freestyling it live. He's freestyling it live. When you go give the, give a speech at the office, when you went to go give a speech in class, how many times did your nervous ass read that shit before you had to go stand in front of your classroom with like fucking 22 people? Multi-millions. You know you're a million people going to see it off the cabeza and you body it. Stop. Stop. Shout out to the homie in black tea. Shout out to the homie in red sweater. Come off the top of the brain. Y'all know I'm loving the flames. Dude, this is insane. Hey, I'll let the elbow my lyrics is about to remain. And I'm insane. I am the greatest. Y'all know I'll be in my face. These rappers better than placebo. Cause you know that they ain't even real. These fake what's it about to take. I be preaching on the mic like a rapper ring. No placebo effect. My freestyle is about to be the medicine. I'ma make it happen. Over MCs, y'all know I'm about to tower. Cause when I rhyme, I be grand 
Mm -hmm. And as the piano became more prevalent and then like with medicine, he started getting into that singing or pocket. It's just adding more of a delivery. I've been saying we needed a Harry Mac album for like the last 20 reactions, right? But one better. We need some Marcus Veltri samples and we need some for my nigga ramen noodle soup. Can we get a KB do war for my nigga ramen? Come on, man. Is I always go back to that reaction where right? y'all, if you are a KBD family member, drop family in the chat if you remember this only. When I said, I don't know if Harry Mack could do a, a battle, because like, I've never really heard him be like, very pompous. I've never really heard him like, go at somebody. Then you start to hate, nah, he do. <laughs> nah, he do. He just doing the real slick ass way. He do though, he be talking his shit. He be definitely talking his shit. He Larry Legend. He Larry Bird with it. He do which one of you bitches take a second. You know what I'm saying? He just do it in a little bit different way. <laughs> Lyrics with incredible speed. I be spitting out bars like they sunflower seeds. Huh? Breaking up out of my shell. Yeah. When I be robbing, I'm doing too well. And that's a W. You gotta like spin them out like sunflower seeds. I'm breaking them out of my shells. You gotta give it to them. Breaking them out of my shell. When I be robbing, I'm doing too well. Leaving the water. I am a father. They know that I'm hotter than hell. Yo, look at his face. He is locked in. Bro, look at this nigga's face. He is focused, boy. <laughs> tell you niggas why i love live instrumentation there's just a grandiose like an epicness to it that that it's very hard for like computer generated sounds to really replicate there's just like the violin there's just like a war slash like a like there's like a pristine and like I don't know, like prim and properness, but it's triumphant and it's gritty and there's a battle to it, but it's it's like a samurai to me, you know? It's very elegant, it's very well put together, it has very, but boy, that motherfucker would chop your goddamn head off. The piano has so much soil, you can hit so many different pockets. If it's an electric piano, you could play any fucking uh, uh, instrument off. There's so much that just because these things are alive, and I guess an electric piano, eh, nothing beats it, bro. Yo, that was fire. Uh, so I was watching y'all on YouTube yesterday. Oh, it's bro, awesome. this shit is getting out of yeah, hand. Every guys day in the algorithm. YouTube. The one playing the piano is Marcus Valtteri. Yeah. The one singing is H Mac, and I would know the one who plays the violin, but I forgot his uh, the name. Rob Landis. All right, I'm going to subscribe to both of y'all. Thank you, bro. Thank you for listening, man. Glad you liked it. That nigga said thank you. What if you could do SEO smarter? Oh, come on, Canada. I forgot my line. Fuck you. Because what does this... Can somebody drop his name in the comments? And if I remember, I'm going to pin it. Because he ain't ramen noodles. But that's just what we call him in the streets. I would love to get That's me. That's me. 
You should do a freestyle. Uh, I would love to do a freestyle. So actually, uh, me and my friend Marcus, we're, we're trying to do a, you know, like a tribute song to you. So could you share with me like maybe one or two things that are meaningful to you? This is gonna sound like a little off, but I'm really passionate about like plants and like gardening. Mm, like, that's dope. That's amazing. Hell yeah, botany, what kind of plants botany, do you have? You know what I'm I, have a, I, I remember when right? I was in like ninth grade, nigga, I tried to get in the botany because I was like, man, if I could be the nigga growing this shit, I'm gonna flood the streets, okay? If I'm the one growing it, who's gonna fuck with me? Well, it's not, it's, it's a little harder than you would think. I killed about 40 plants. But boy, we was getting them Reggie C's. Boy, we be smoking the Reggie. Talking about some. Boy, if you hear the seed crackling, take it out. Take it out. You heard me? <laughs> take what? it out. Well, he's not like a tree tree yet, but he's still, he's a little, little he's baby. On, he's a little baby. He's a, what's his name? I don't know. I've been named it. Okay, all right. Rock. Name forthcoming. All right, so we're going to do something strong, about uh, your plants, like which you're very passionate strong, about. Your little baby avocado tree that one day will be a full grown tree. Does that sound good? Yes. All right, let's get it. All right, let's kick the avocado <laughs> tree song. Yeah. Yeah. Oop. Oh, uh, that's all my fucking avocados out there. Yeah. Bro. Yeah. Drop yeah. an avocado in the chat, bro. Drop an avocado. If you've never done anything in me for me in your goddamn life, drop an avocado in the chat, man. And a thumbs up. <laughs> I called you a man, nigga. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, yo, I'm avocado. here to tell a story in the... F yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, yo, I'm here to tell a story in the form of a hot flow. A story about a baby avocado. A little baby. Still in a pot, yo. Just a young sprout. Just... Nah. And I love that when you switch up where the 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 end rhyme should be, the avocado and the pop bro just like added that little pot in there. You didn't see it coming. It just adds a little. <laughs> yeah, hey yo, I'm here to tell a story in the form of a hot flow, a story about a baby avocado still in a pot, yo, just a young sprout, just getting started all up on this route. One day in the future, it will be in the ground. One day in the future, its soul will be found. Can you imagine? Sunshine and bright, the avocado is right. You squeeze it. Come on, this nigga fucking me up right now. And that bitch looking at my plant like, hold on, come here, baby. I ain't even know. I ain't such a precious, goddamn beautiful. Mwah, I just want to just fuck it. And this is just such a damn Harry Mac. I ain't even know my. Mm, okay. When everything is right, under sun shining bright, the avocado is right. You squeeze it, you're like, damn, I want some boss shit. Because this avocado is the perfect softness. <laughs> you pluck it down from the tree. You're like, this is the perfect food for me. Oh my god, this avocado is way above average and full of omega 3 fatty acids. Oh, this nigga still goes. <laughs> <laughs> this nigga is the guy. My fuck, everybody got fucked up off that bar. That was too, that was literally too good. And a, and a, a tree is a beautiful. I'm in here thinking like, damn, a tree is such a beautiful thing. Like if you nurture it and take care of it, it'll feed you. It's not just so beautiful. And then I'm like, nigga, what the fuck am I to, uh, to avocado tree? Man, I got that's a money tree right there. You know what I'm on? Fuck, you talking about? Drop that thumbs up button. <laughs> that guac but i've been looking at it like you just think i'm a sucker ain't it nigga i'm already paying like 11 dollars for the bowl and then don't let me try your new shit actually let me not even because yeah they ain't cut the check let me not even tell you that they got some new shit it's pretty good job go get it man they ain't cut the check when i give them a freebie it's pretty good but nigga i be looking at that guac like extra 213 nigga what come on nigga i was born i just wasn't born yesterday you hear me Buy this at Chipotle. We charge extra for avocado. No way. I got my own at home. So I'm gonna get my own avocado and really get in the zone. Harry Mack is a real, like, dad ass nigga. Boy, I just won't put it on there. If you go home and put your own guacamole on that bitch, you are a cheap fuck. <laughs> 
Yeah, and this tree is oh so holy. It also gives me the guacamole. Yeah. I'm in the kitchen, chop it up. I'm having fun, son. I add a little jalapeno and some onion. Woo. I add a little salt and a little pepper. Oh. I mash that up till I got the perfect texture. Okay, that's a that's a good guacamole recipe. That little jalapeno. Make sure you keep the jalapeno juice to add it in there. What's y'all guacamole recipe? I'll put it. His shit was there. But I'm going to put a little bit of lemon juice in that little motherfucker. I got a couple of things I'm going to put in mine that's going <laughs> to take it over the top. But you remember when I told you there's not a man alive that can outcook me. I'm right here, folks. Come on. Come on. I'm in Texas. Come pull up at the grill. We can get on that barbecue right now. Imagine a better life. Yo, I can't. All of this came from a baby little plant. It's exactly what we need. I mean, this whole grown tree came from one tiny seed. That's a metaphor for life. We make a small effort. It is a metaphor for life. It really is. Tree came from one tiny seed. That's a metaphor for life. We make a small effort. And what comes from it is impossible to measure. I mean, sometimes the truth is really right here. One centimeter turns to a light year. Mm. That's so amazing. Like, I always say, like, I, I, I went to go see. Let me see if this is over. <laughs> oh, my God. Thank you. Do you want to name? For, I think you. Wait. Admit, um, Todd. Todd? I ain't mad at Todd. Dang, dang. Sleep. Get yeah, I always appreciate somebody who's really invested in something. Like, she's really into plants. I was talking to this nigga when I bought a bed. I went in there to buy, like, a $200 mattress, left with, like, a couple thousand dollar mattress with, like, a hydraulic bed set. Because the guy was so passionate about beds, it made me want to be passionate about beds for that little bit. And I thought about it, and I was like, I do got a deviated septum, and I do need to sleep at an angle that needs to be adjusted so I can control this motherfucker snoring. And that's what I did, and I'm proud of it. And yeah, I'm making payments. And that was a certified five check. And here comes another reaction by Mary Here Ping, music video by Mary Here Ping. Hit that thumbs up button if you're new to the channel. Hey, how are you doing? Hit that subscribe button, or your grandma's a hoe. So stop being a hoe. I'm gone. And you're a hoe too, don't you? This ain't just on granny either. <laughs>